this is Saint Queen back again with another video. I mean, as you guys know, we are consistent. If you're new here, thank you for stopping by. Please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Trust me, you're gonna love it here. And if you're a returning subscriber, then thank you so so much for coming back. I feel like I always start my videos off with me going somewhere, and today is no different. So this is day one of the vloggy vlog vlog, and I'm about to step out. I have a little date <laughs> that I'm going to, and I'm gonna take you guys with me. But before I go, let me show you guys my outfits. I want something that's very cute, very elegant, but also very sexy at the same time. So I'm wearing this two-piece blazer squat set from Zara. And then underneath, I'm wearing this bra top. It's actually a bra, but it doubles as a top. And then when I step into the restaurant, I'm just gonna, you know, cover it like this. That's what I'm saying. It looks elegant though, guys. You see what I mean? And then I'm also just wearing these high heel boots. Initially, when I had this outfit in my head, I wanted to wear it with um, sandal heels, but it's so cold. <laughs> it is freezing cold. So I hope I don't regret my outfit choice while I'm on the date. And then my bag of choice is this one. I feel like it makes a lot of sense though, because like I'm wearing black. And you guys already know, in terms of jewelry, like I'm a gold jewelry type of girl. And this is gold hardware. You guys see what I mean? Like I'm wearing my gold Van Cleef and our pearls and necklace. I'm wearing my gold Louis Vuitton earrings. And the gold hardware from the Balenciaga bag just makes so much sense, guys. And can we please have a moment of silence for my makeup though? Like, eight. Eight. <laughs> but yeah, I'm just gonna charge my phone and just rest a bit before I step out. And I will catch up with you guys later.
welcome to another day of the vlogly vlog vlog it's actually the end of the day as you guys can tell but i was literally in such a rush that i didn't even introduce the day like oh my goodness today was a maintenance day and guys i don't know if it's just me but i feel like there's nothing relaxing about maintenance like there's nothing relaxing about doing your nails and doing your hair and your lashes like personally i hate it like i wish that i could remove my hands and then just put them on the table so that they can do the nails while i do something else like i know it doesn't even sound practical but that's how much i hate doing maintenance guys i hate having to wait for the lady to finish with my lashes i hate having to wait for them to do my nails wait for them to do my toes wait for them to install my hair like the whole process is just so stressful to me i don't like it it's not relaxing to me so yeah um but i actually tried a new place <laughs> i tried a new place the place was located in work off and as i had mentioned in my previous vlog i've just been trying different places because i want to find my place you know like i want to have a go-to place where i go for like specific things and i know that okay this is the place that i go like i'm one of those people i like to be very loyal to places and things like i'm very loyal when you're loyal guard me like guys so i want to find a place that i can be loyal to like a place that's gonna be my ride or die and honestly i've been struggling to find a place like that here in cape town because i'm very pedantic not even gonna lie i am extremely pedantic i'm so particular wow but um yeah like do let me know if they ate this installation or not but throughout the whole process i was even so annoyed because um in addition to me not even liking to do maintenance in the first place they were doing multiple treatments at the same time because i did tell them that i don't want to stay here for long you know so while they were doing my lashes they were also doing my toes and while they were doing my hands they were doing my hair installation so it was quite difficult for me to vlog the entire process nicely but when i do go back hopefully i can vlog it nicely for you guys but trust me when i say that place is it is stunning uh these are how the nails look <laughs> i did white on my hands and also on my feet because you know i'm all about that matchy matchy vibe and i don't usually go for a length this long but in the spirit of trying new things i decided to just try a longer length than what i usually do and i did shorter lashes because in the other vlog i don't know if you guys remember but i felt like i looked a bit odd with the lashes and i figured maybe it's because the lashes were like a little bit long but now that i have these short ones i'm realizing that's not why <laughs> that's not why i actually prefer those other ones to these ones and i think it's solely because of the length so next time i'm going to just do like a longer length but yeah guys please tell me like from what you're seeing like is it worth going back like did they eat or what because i want to go back but i want you guys to be honest like should i go back like should i give them another chance like i don't know and also in addition to the whole maintenance day i hung up the wall art that you guys are seeing behind me i did that myself guys i literally did that myself and i actually wanted to have three frames because i bought three different wall arts but then um i got this at crazy store the frame at crazy store they only had one black frame available and i didn't want the white so i just took the only frame that they had available and I told myself that um, when I have the time, I just need to go to a different crazy store and hope that they have this exact frame and then just get two more so that I can hang it on either side of the frame that you guys are currently seeing now so that, you know, we have a nice, nice look, nice aesthetic going on. And yeah, I really like the wall art. I feel like it matches my place so well. When I put it up, I was like, wow, it's... I was like, girl, you ate that. Plus, like, guys, I'm so proud because I literally did it myself. Like, I literally... I bought double-sided tape. And it was just me and the tape against the world. And I measured everything myself to make sure that it's straight, to make sure that it's even. And it was not easy. It was not easy. But, you know, like, a girl like me is going to get things done. So, I got it done. 
and now i just want to sleep <laughs> i just want to rest i'm so tired like i'm literally the most tired girl in south africa so i am going to go to bed and i will catch up with you guys on a another day good night hey guys welcome to another day of the vloggy vlog vlog i really don't feel all that great today so i just figured that i would use today to finally do my luxury unboxing i've been meaning to do this and i have cheated a little bit because i have worn one of the things that i'm about to show you guys but i really wanted to do an unboxing because personally i consume a lot of luxury content that's the kind of content that i like to see so every now and then even if it's not every time i would love to do a little bit of an unboxing here and there and as a disclaimer guys also remember that like all of us have different life paths and all of us are on different chapters you can't compare your chapter 7 with somebody else's chapter 19 that's not a fair comparison so yeah i just wanted to get that out of the way and let me <laughs> get into this unboxing oh my goodness guys i'm so excited all of these things are things that i really like obviously since i chose them these are things that i really like um let me get into <laughs> let me start with the small bag that has the smallest little box so this is the one where i have cheated a little bit because i have already worn this that you guys are about to see for the ones that follow me on instagram you guys already know these earrings so if you're not following me on instagram do the right thing okay and go follow me on instagram <laughs> but um these are the earrings these are the lv stud earrings yeah these are the new ones you guys probably have seen the other ones the classics that a lot of people have been wearing lately the one with the l and the v is quite big but i really liked these because I just felt like they're so simple, so classic, so understated and um, I chose the gold one because I like gold, so, like I'm a gold jewelry type of girl. On to the next box, so <laughs> guys, this bracelet, this bracelet so pretty so stunning so this is the i think it's called the cuffed bracelet because it literally opens and like it, it cuffs <laughs> so this is how it is mind you putting this thing on and taking it off is a mission but this is a very stunning bracelet very simple very cute yeah and I chose this one specifically because um, I wanted to kind of do like a stack type of thing. So I already have um, my Christian Dior bracelet, the one that's very dainty. And then I wanted something a little bit thick, hence I chose this one to kind of have like a variety of bracelets as like arm candy. But yeah, moving on to this bag okay ah! <laughs> oh my goodness i'm so excited you guys are gonna see why i'm excited just now <laughs> but this is very very pretty so pretty all righty We have a twilly and guys I am into the classics so I got this one very beautiful very classical I feel like this is gonna go with like a lot of outfits and I plan on wearing it two ways so sometimes I will put it like on my head and then sometimes I just wanna 
you know, like, you know, do a little something, something. You guys get the point, right? So, yeah, and it's basically the same both ways. Like, it's the same pattern at the back and the front. And I also really like that it's black and white, so it's gonna go with a lot of things. A lot of things. And guys, I noticed like with the twillies from LV, they're a lot thicker than the twillies from Gucci. Because the twillies that I have from Gucci are not this wide. Like, this is actually quite big. This is actually really big. But I'm not complaining. I'm not complaining. I really, really love it. So much. <laughs> so, we have this very big box <laughs> um yeah and we have a pair of shoes we have a pair of shoes um guys <laughs> these are very pretty and the thing that i like about them is that they're different so i'm sure you guys have seen this kind of shoe very frequently but this specific one that makes me like like it even more is that like it's different like it's the same shape same idea but then it's different in the sense that it has this um i'm not quite sure exactly what it's called but you see this part here that like opens and closes and like this is just this is not the normal one <laughs> this is not the normal one and then this shoe says Vuitton and this one right here says Louis so that's also pretty cool let me just take it out for you guys so that you can see it for yourselves <laughs> there we go yeah so it says Louis Vuitton as you guys can see yeah so so cute so so comfortable that's literally it for the unboxing um i hope that you enjoyed it because <laughs> i enjoyed my purchases a lot i love them a lot and i'm just gonna spend the rest of the day resting i don't quite feel very well so i will catch up with you guys on another day and if you're enjoying this video so far please don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up and subscribe if you're not subscribed yet i am feeling so low vibrational and i need a little pick me up so i am going to the mall and i'm going to be taking you guys with me we just need to get a few things there but don't worry i'm going to be vlogging the entire thing my outfit of the day is literally it's nothing special like i'm just wearing sweatpants i'm wearing this sweatshirt and i am using this bag you know very simple very chilled very chic and most importantly very warm because it is so cold
guys, I'm back home and let's do an unboxing of everything that I got from the mall today. This one is not for me, so I'm not going to show you guys what's inside. Let's start with the stuff from Zara. Okay guys, I'm so excited. <laughs> Alright, first things first. I got this dress. I already have the black version of this dress and I just figured that you know what? Since I already have the flag, I might as well put the white. And please look at how elegant this dress looks. Plus, I don't really have like white dresses, so it just makes sense. And then, next up is this jacket. From the previous vlog, not the previous vlog, the vlog before the previous vlog, you guys should have seen the brown jacket that I've got. Um, that one was like a chocolate, like a deep dark chocolate brown and then this is more like a milk chocolate brown so yeah like plus it's winter guys like it's so cold you know i just wanted something to be warm in <laughs> and then i also got this shirt this top yeah not a shirt this top um you know i wanted something long sleeve something very basic, something essential, something that I could wear with a lot of things. And again, I also have this in white. So I just figured I might as well get it in a different color. You know what they say? If it's nice, you need to buy it twice. I also got this perfume. So everyone is always raving about how Zara has improved their perfume formulas and how their perfumes last much longer now. So I was like, you know what? I like to see that for myself. So since I was there, I figured I might as well just get a Zara perfume. So this is the Zara Sublime Epoque. It smells, um, it's very floral guys. It's very floral and I'm a floral girl. I know it doesn't make sense because it's winter now, but like I'm a floral girl through and through. I don't even care if it's raining. I don't care if it's winter. I don't care if I'm in the desert. Like I want to smell flowers. So of course I had to get a floral perfume. I finally replaced those washing towels that I had told you guys about also in the previous two vlogs when I accidentally used um, bleach and it dyed my washing towels to a very funny looking color. So yeah, hopefully I don't make the same mistake. And then I also got um, refills for my diffusers. This is from Mr. Price Home, by the way. I didn't get a bag for it because I just felt like it could fit in the Zara bag, so I was just like, mm, let me just throw it in there. And then from Cotton On, guys, I still love Cotton On through and through. Make no mistake. I got this lint roller. I always forget to buy lint rollers, and I actually need it so much because, like, I always get stuff on my clothes, and it's just not a good look. I just feel like as a lady, you should have a lint roller. So if you don't have a lint roller, please go buy a lint roller for my sake. I also got these cute slippers. Guys, how cute is the color? And also because like my Calvin Klein slippers got damaged. I got them washed and then the lady who was washing them didn't do a good job. So now they're damaged and I can't wear them again. Well, technically I could wear them again, but they don't look good. They don't look good. And the thing about a color like this is that like, yeah, def, I like it's so delicate, so fragile. So like one mistake, your shoes are not going to look the same. So my shoes didn't look the same anymore and i just got these for time being because i was also at cotton on so i just figured like since i'm here i might as well and cotton on is usually always having like these specials and stuff so they had a special for socks it was three for 150 so i chose these i just liked the way this design was i mean this is to match with the pajamas that i'm about to show you now and i also just got white socks because like you always need white socks you know these are the pajamas that I was talking about. I got these purple pajamas and they're long sleeve. They're very thick. So I'm sure they're going to be warm. I need them to be warm because it's very cold, guys. Like, oh my goodness, at night, at night, I am fighting for my life. Like, there's literally me and my electric blanket against the world. So I just need to have good pajamas on my side this marks the end of this lovely vlog vlog thank you guys for watching if you got up to this point 
you're so real like you're so real i do it for you okay i do it for you please don't forget to give this video a huge thumbs up and subscribe if you're not subscribed yet until next time this is it from the consistent queen bye